Welcome back for my morning pot analysis videos on Tuesday 15th of May with me, which pair market analyst at Handtech Markets. Looking at Dolly N, which continues in its uptrend, doesn't it? Uh, held on to that uptrend yesterday. Did test the uptrend, but certainly closing back towards the high of the day yesterday. And again, we're moving towards that 110 figure level, 110.02, 1001, 110 big figure. It is really testing that level, and it um, if it can break out through that level, then that would be up, up and away again, um, forming a little breakout. You could argue a consolidation range of um, around about 140 pips of, of upside move. That would give you sort of around about the mid 111s, which within the context of that is pretty much that high there. So uh, a possibility of uh, regaining the um, the momentum to the upside having had this consolidation. I mean, consolidations do tend to sort of run on this uh, on this rally on uh, dollar yen, as in you have the consolidation and the breakout. Consolidation, could we be on the brink of a breakout? Momentum indicators sort of been fluctuating around in recent days, giving sort of positive and negative signals periodically, but ticking higher again. That uh, RSI still hanging on to 60 was a positive, and uh, MACD lines sort of plateaued, but not really considered next move. But certainly, I think this chart s suggests that we are sort of bring uh, on the brink of a breakout, because you're now starting to see the RSI pulling above 70 on the ma on the uh, hourly chart, whereas through the consolidation previously, it was sort of failing around that level. See, let's see how the MACD lines start to perform, but uh, it certainly looks relatively positively configured and ha certainly is having a go at 110 figure at the moment and uh, closing breakout would certainly open the upside and uh, that would be what you'd be looking out for that uh, 108.60 level is increasingly important on a, on a near to medium term basis now as a, a reaction low as a higher reaction low so with that in mind I wish you good luck in trading and I'll speak to you later